January 12, 2012, marks the 100th anniversary of the start of the historic Bread and Roses strike in Lawrence, Massachusetts. We welcome you to the opening of Short Pay All Out to commemorate the centennial of the Bread and Roses strike of 1912. This strike had a power that resonated. This is such a vitally important part of American history that people know so little about. The strike lasted for eight weeks and captured the interest of the entire nation. One half of all the workers at the neighboring American woolen mills were girls 14 to 18 years old. One third of our week was in this mill. Eight hours a day for seven days. Mortality rate was 50% for children who were the age of six. The strike was really about collective action. People from all different nationalities and all different languages coming together to push one idea and vision forward. Workers' rights were put on the national radar screen by the men, women, and children from Lawrence. We're here where workers tended the looms and the spinning machines. You can see their imprints in the floor. And this is where the people stood and worked those long, brutal hours for very little pay and finally said, enough. There aren't any other strikes that are celebrated 100 years later. That's how powerful what happened right out there on Essex Street, right here in this building 100 years ago today, really was. This mill, among others, remains standing as monuments to the work, the labor, the people that were here in the past, and it's very appropriate for the exhibit to be here. It's in the precise location where the strike began, on the sixth floor of the Everett Mill. If you stand here and you understand this was the first place where people walked out, you sort of can suck in the air. And so, as a historian, you don't have that many opportunities to sort of go back to a space. Their victory here in Lawrence opened the door to many other victories, which led to health and safety laws, to the 40-hour work week, child labor laws, and many things that we take for granted. It is important to remember the gains in workers' rights that were paid for with the blood, sweat, and tears of the textile workers in Lawrence. Short Pay All Out is an exhibit that is really the launch for a whole year's worth of events celebrating the centennial. If you care about these issues of equality, fairness, of social justice, coming to the exhibit and coming to many of the events that are going to be happening over the course of the year will resonate with you. We did this for the people of Lawrence and visitors to understand this history and to take ownership of it and to make it part of their lives.